Hello, in this video we're gonna check all available gestures and motions for lock screen in Xiaomi Redmi Note 12. To do this we'll need to open our settings, now locate additional settings at the bottom, select gesture shortcuts and now let's check which of the options work in the lock screen. First one is launch Google Assistant. If you enable it, you'll be able to press and hold the power button for half a second to call out Google Assistant. And as you can see on unlocked phone, it works great. Now let's check if it's the same on a locked phone. Yep, it works fine. Now let's close the Google Assistant and move on to another feature which is take screenshot, there's two options, you can slide down your three fingers to make a screenshot or use volume down plus power key to make a screenshot. Let's try it on unlocked phone. Both of them work fine, now let's lock our phone, then move to the uh, lock screen but our phone needs to be waked up, wake, waken up and now let's try to use it. This one works fine, and another one also great. Next feature is hold three fingers to take a partial screenshot, and on the unlocked phone works great when the phone is locked. Not as much, so this doesn't work. Next is launch camera, and here you can double press the power button or double press volume down button when your phone is locked to enable camera. So it works on your unlocked phone, and let's try it on the lock one. Yep, both of the features work great. Next, turn on torch. If you enable it, you will need to replace the camera with that. And here, if we double press the power button, it will enable the flashlight. and it works fine on the locked phone. Next feature is, uh, and the last one, is a double tap fingerprint sensor to enable one of these functions. And in this case, maybe let's go for the torch flashlight. So we need to double tap the uh, fingerprint sensor and it's a power key at the same time. And don't press it, just double tap like that and it should enable the camera, I mean the flashlight. Yep, it's fine. Now let's try to disable it on locked phone, but it doesn't work when your phone is locked. And that's it for this video, hope you like it, please consider subscribing to our channel, leave a like and a comment below.